guys welcome back to my channel so um i'm gonna film my last halloween um swap i know it's late in the month but i really do enjoy crafting for halloween and um i reached out to jennifer she is raven lou and paper too um she had posted this picture of this really um beautiful cauldron purse she made and she had mentioned that she um I couldn't didn't get to swap it, so I, was, I just gave her um, DM her, and she said um, yes to to swapping with me. So I'm gonna show you um, what I'm gonna send her. We're basically going to or swapping a Halloween bag, a memory dex card, and embellishments and some goodies. So I'm gonna start off with the embellishment card that I'm gonna send her. So this is the embellishment card I'm gonna send her. And this is um, one of the Sanderson sisters. I believe this is Mary. And over here, I basically use some um, chipboard and, and ephemera from the Luna collection. And this is just some Halloween ephemera. I don't really remember what, what collection that one is exactly from. And these stars are from there. And this is a cut file that um, Roxy had sent me. And she's, hello, my name is Roxy. Um, and I thought, uh, she gave me, she sent me three, all three of the ladies, the Sanderson sisters. And I decided to make this into a memory dex card. And I got a felt spider web here and uh, some eyelash black eyelash trim so that's the memory dex card and uh well i can mind i'll show you this is one of the goodies i'm gonna send her this is um some halloween socks and this is a box that i actually have a tutorial for i will send um link it down below it's not a box but um a container and i have this cute little dangle charm here this is an eraser from target and then you know i sewed around the paper and i created this embellishment um this spooky was given to me in a swap and uh i forgot what collection this is <laughs> but i really like how that came out and then um I made these pinwheel bat bows, and I think these came out really cute. Um, this is a cut file, and it is, uh, I forgot who it is, but I will try to um, link it down below. And this bow is also a cut file, and it's a, um, I found it from Etsy. And then I put some eyelash trim and like one of those chipboards from Target. And this one I put a, what you, a skeleton. So I'm going to center those. And then, hold on one second. And then I also made these shakers while I was crafting for other um, swaps. So I thought um, since I had them, um, I will send them to her. And these are both KS Craft um, dies. And this is the new one this year, the Cat Cup. And this is the, front, the Cauldron one. So I'm gonna send her those. And then um, I am sending her other goodies that I am putting in this. I'm gonna try to put a lot of this stuff in this cute little cat bag that I had gotten in Dollar Tree and there's some goodies in there that I'm sending her. And then I also made her this cute little cauldron, which is another KS Craft die. It's that cauldron die. I believe this is the small one that I got. So I put some, I put it together and then I put some black and white stripe ribbon and then I made this cute little embellishment here. I forgot the name of this collection as I have just put all my Halloween stuff away. I'm really, um, <laughs> I think I'm done now. 
Um, and I used this crepe paper rosette that I got from April. And then, um, like I said, I forgot what this collection is. And then I made this uh, ruffle trim thing. I'm sorry. And inside here is just some candy. That, And then I just stuffed the shred to look like it was like a boiling over cauldron. And then, so the main uh, reason we're swapping is this uh, to make a Halloween bag. And this is a coffin bag that I made. Just move these a little bit out of the way. And this coffin bag is actually a tutorial from Amy. She's Amy L. Crafts, and I will also link it down below. And it was very easy to make. Um, her tutorial is very easy to follow and I just really love how this came out and it does zip I'll unzip that after I put some um, uh, uh, this is a die cut that I had a little piece of the cobwebs and I just put it on that side for, for decorating and then I had this chain that I'm using as you know the handle of the bag and then I created this cute little um, dangle here on the side with some beads and I have a cute little ghost charm and this is a pumpkin bell and then this little charm here that says uh, boo and then I made this ribbon and tied it here it's like a velvet ribbon um, and this is a mix of collections. This is actually uh, a swap that I did with V. I think it was last year. And I thought that would go really well here. It's a little um, flag. And then I just had some random pumpkins in my... I kind of mixed all my Halloween together. I stacked two of them. And this bird is also just random. I forgot where that came from. And this is act from Hey Pumpkin. And it says, Hey Pumpkin. And then I used some uh, creepy cloth. And then I did put some... Um, th so this this is the piece from this cobweb that was left over. And then this is from the cl Close to My Heart, their Halloween collection from last year. And then, like I said, uh, I have some stuff in here for her. Some more embellishments. And it really does open pretty wide, so you can fit quite a bit in here. So I'm just going to move this over here. So I made her these Halloween bows. More bows. Sorry for the glare. Decided to just pack up everything. Um, I'm going to put this pen. This... Uh, Skeleton hand pen. This is from Target. Uh, this is another embellishment I had created already. Um, this was actually for Craft Purge's uh, giveaway she had recently to create uh, embellishments you die using dyes that are not typically Halloween. And this is the Chaos Craft uh, Circus tent die and then I used this pick from Dollar Tree this year and this is the this word fun is from that die and the stickers from Dollar Tree and this was gifted to me so that's one set and then um, I made these star embellishments here's this one sorry for the glare so it's a, it's not a regular shape star, but those long, oh, I forget the word every time I come on the video. <laughs> and like I said, just a mix of collections. I put some eyelash trim and the word candy and sewed on it. And these little puffy uh, bats. These are the stickers a while ago from the Target or the Hallmark um, ones. I made her two of those. Oops. And here's the other one that I made for her. So 
Sorry, it's a little difficult to come out. Here's the other one. And this one I kind of use uh, from the Luna Collection. I actually like this Luna Collection. It wasn't too pink. And it had a little bit of orange, and I really liked it. And it's one of the, the stars again. I really like this. And this little ghosty is also from that Luna Collection. And then I put another one of those puppy bats from the Hallmark. And then I also <laughs> included some of the KS Craft Halloween dye words. Some of them are sold across and some of them aren't. And then the last thing that's in here is this um, broom banner that I created. And I do have a tutorial for this from last year. I will also link that down below if you want um, to create some. And it doesn't have to necessarily be Halloween, but you know. So um, let me just take it out so you guys see a little bit better. So this is like a foam um, piece. And I just backed it with the glitter paper and put the... Uh, Nouveau drops here and this is the skeleton from Target a while back and then I put a little tassel here orange pom-pom um, pleated some paper and put the word beware um, not sure where this pumpkin came from these little this little bow right here was actually given to me by Amy in um, Halloween happy birthday mail she gave me and like I said, it is a banner and this is the witch broom that I did the paper and the flock to tool that they have at the Dollar Tree. So this is what I'm going to be sending Jennifer. I hope she likes um, everything that I created for her. And I just want to uh, thank you guys for sticking around. I know it's a late um, Halloween swap, but like I said, I really love Halloween and I kind of needed to get it out of my system. And don't forget to like this video, um, subscribe if you like, and thank you for joining me again. Bye.